Hey guys, it's Lost Karen Boy again. Anyways, ah, uh, I know it's been a while since uh, I posted a video. Uh, uh, I've been so uh, lazy lately. You know, I have not done anything. Oh my gosh. Ooh, just a lot of exploring. Uh, not really focused on videos at all. I don't know why. But yeah, I'm gonna get back to my grind. You know, editing more videos. So um, yeah, stay tuned. Anyways, this is a continuous uh, vlog from the previous one. Uh, so this is a Canada part, okay? So this will show you the highlights of what's going on in Canada and what we did and what happened up there. Okay, so yeah. The journey continues. We were up in Canada. We don't know where we stand or um, what we doing up there. So. Uh, yeah, we were lost basically, but um, you know, we knew that we were gonna go up there and explore whatever happens happens, right? Um, but yeah, next thing uh, There's a, a guy Billy, uh, you know, he hit us up on uh, Instagram uh, You know um, Offered us to come through So um, yeah, we did um, we come through Billy, you know, uh, he was a cool guy you know, he was willing to share with us his um, everything, like his tiny place, um, his food, his water, his Wi-Fi, you know. Um, yeah, but most importantly, he was willing to share with us um, all those memories that uh, we shared together. And we've created um, just adventuring around uh, Lake Louis. So yeah, um, this is what happened with Billy. This is what we did. Now, before we go any further, this is situation. Uh, so, Billy is having three guests coming over from BC. Uh, and um, us, we have nowhere to stay. Uh, but Billy told us that, you know, we can stay uh, nearby campgrounds uh, from his place. And I just explore around. And, um, you know, we can come back um, after the weekend or on the weekend on Sunday. Because the guests are only going to be there a couple of days. Uh, or basically just one night and one day and then they're going back so yeah we did that uh, Billy pointed us out to some nearby campgrounds we went there uh, we got lost because um, we had like no connections up there in Canada no service at all so yeah we don't know where we're staying uh, but you know we told ourselves that we'll figure it out um, next thing the guests you know um, they wanted to meet us so um, yeah we we decided to meet up with them. Uh, it's cool. It's fun time. Anyways, these are the three guests: uh, the Kiko, Lalu, and Dinari. And um, yeah, they were some cool girls. Like they were, they were fun. They were adventurous, just like us. And we were down to ride with them, you know, to adventure with them. So next thing we know, we were gonna camp out together. Um, so yeah, we did. We did that. We went camping together. Uh, we cooked uh, <laughs> out in the wild and then, you know, uh, we went adventure together. So it was a fun time with them, good memories.
but yeah by, by then we felt like we were all friends so yeah it's good stuff uh, anyways we knew that our time in uh, Lake Louis with Billy uh, was gonna have to come to an end because you know that's a part of the travel we're gonna have to continue our next to our next destination uh, to Jasper so yeah but before I go I just wanted to say thank you Billy for everything that you have done you know you really made us better people uh, you really made us um, appreciate more and believe that there's good in this world you know there's good people everywhere all around that's willing to help so we have faith you know we believe and uh, we're gonna keep going on this journey and yeah we won't stop okay so thank you my friend I'll see you next time when I see you hopefully somewhere down the road that's beautiful hopefully you have an idea of where it will be all right so yeah Anyways, we went to Jasper, uh, we were lost up there, we don't know what we're doing. Uh, we had a plan, but then it's like, it didn't go according to plan, so yeah, we were lost. Basically, we stopped by um, a, a fast food restaurant and then we called Lalu, uh, one of the guests from uh, Lake Louis that came from BC. So. Um, so yeah, we called Lalu and then we told her that we're gonna come through to Vancouver, and uh, yeah, she was uh, um, she was excited. She uh, welcomed us. So next thing we knew, we drove down to BC in the middle of the night. Uh, we got tired, so we stopped by a rest area on our way, and then we just sleep in our van. I woke up next morning, continued the journey to BC. On our way to Vancouver, we stopped by this river beside the the highway. Um, we just parked across the side of the highway and then we just uh, walked to the river and just swim. Yeah, it felt more refreshing. Um, swimming is kind of like in our bloods, you know, like I've kind of realized that every river, every um, lake we see, we just kind of tend to jump in, no matter how hot or cold or warm or whatever it is, uh, deep or shallow, we just jump in. So yeah, it's kind of crazy. I guess it's kind of installed in our blood that, you know, we just jump in whatever we see. So yeah, anyways, continue uh, to BC, uh, to Vancouver. So we got to Vancouver and this is what happened in Vancouver.
but yeah uh, it was some fun time we really did enjoy a lot um, in BC in Vancouver we did many many things um, everybody had work so like we didn't have like a whole day of exploring but whatever time we had we did went out and explore uh, Lalu she I'm really proud of her she was willing to go to work for the whole day from early morning till like evening and then she would come back home and it'd take us around go explore go see new things go see new places and she's very adventurous it's like honestly I would say more adventurous than us so yeah she really welcomed us and uh, helped us out and show us around and it felt like home we felt really welcome. Also, her family is like, they're so funny. <laughs> they're so friendly and nice. Um, yeah, we really enjoy our time there, um, being with her and her family and her friends. Just, uh, we get to go to church and the church uh, welcomed us and made us go up on, on the stage and introduce ourselves and, you know, say a little bit about ourselves. And yeah, it was some good experience. We, uh, we did a lot and it was fun all thanks to the three girls that made it that made a big difference uh for the time that we were there i think without them it would not be the same you know so yeah thank you three girls you know who you guys are the kiko dinnery and lalu you guys are amazing um you know i wish you guys the best with whatever you guys want to do in life um i knew you guys are good people ever since I met you guys uh, ever since the first time that I've met you guys so yeah um, anyways uh, we'll see each other again when we see each other again okay so yeah just stay cool um, stay positive stay kind stay humble just yeah be yourself I guess I don't know how else to say if you just be yourself uh, you can make a b difference in uh, other people's life because you really did make difference in uh, my life and uh, our lives so yeah thank you again we'll see you guys again soon Anyways, we knew that we were gonna have to go um, soon, you know, because that's just a part of the road trip, right? Everything is like temporary, but you know, the memories last forever. So, anyways, our next destination is gonna be Seattle, Washington. So, we head down there and we met some incredible people. It was um, amazing. Good time. So, yeah. Anyways, we went down to Seattle, Washington, and this is what happened in Seattle, Washington. <laughs> The whole time we were there in Seattle, um, it was it was fun. Uh, we were there. We stayed at uh, Brianna's boyfriend's house. Uh, 
they really oh my gosh they were so nice they really welcomed us and helped us and everything they really like just treated us like family you know we also met Emma she's a cool girl she uh, adventurous just like us so you know um, yeah she explored with us took us around and show us some good spots um, it was harder because everybody there have a job everybody there was on their own schedule so like it was kind of hard to do some of the things but um, but we did a lot thanks to uh, some of the some of the guys some of the guys there that helped us out you know show us around and really um, adventure with us you know we really welcomed us and talked to us and we made some friends and you know um, our our time together um, didn't last that long but it was worth it while it lasted you know what I mean they had a they were gonna had a soccer tournament and a race tiring ceremony so we joined them uh, we were part of the community it was fun I took some pictures uh, it wasn't all that good but it was okay you know uh, they liked it so yeah anyways our time in Seattle was fun and uh, memorable so uh, I have to visit again explore some more places but yeah I know that you know our time there is gonna have to come to an end again so uh, skipping forward I just want to say thank you to everybody that welcomed us and helped us and you know uh, show us around you know who you guys are if you're watching this but yeah to our next uh, destination uh, Portland Oregon so yeah here we come we'll see you soon Portland All right, guys. So if you guys like that video, uh, I know that um, uh, it's not all fancy and all that. I'm still trying to get better with my editing. I know it's kind of suck. I need to do more editing so I can get better. But yeah, uh, I'll I'll, uh, I'll experiment with it and try to get it better slowly. Okay. So hang in there. Uh, sooner or later, you'll see some improvements in my videos. Okay. Uh, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, stay tuned for the next vlog. Okay, it's coming up soon. Uh, I will continue posting videos more consistent, I promise. Because, you know, lately I've been so lazy. Uh, I've All I've done was just like sleep, wake up, adventure, come back, sleep, wake up, eat, sleep, wake up, adventure, eat, sleep, wake up, adventure. I have not focused on editing at all. So uh, yeah, I need to focus on that, okay? But yeah, hang in there, be patient with me, okay? Uh, I'll try to stay consistent, okay? Uh, yeah, if you guys like the video, again, give it a thumbs up, uh, share it, you know, subscribe to my YouTube channel at Lost Grand Boy, uh, if you haven't already, to see more videos. And uh, follow me on uh, Instagram at Lost Grand Boy, and uh, like my Facebook page at Lost Grand Boy. Um, so yeah, so, um, thank you. If you, uh, if you really want to uh, be part of this journey, like, you know, hit us up on social media, you, you already know. So um, just, just let me know wherever you're at in the United States or in the world, you know, I, I'm doing this. I'm going to go to many, many more places. So, you know, your destination or wherever you live might be one of the destinations that I might stop by. You just never know. Even if it's not, I might just stop by there purposely just so I can you know go explore with you so yeah if you want to be a part of this journey just hit us up you know on social media let us know if you want us to come through we can go around you can show us around some of the best spots and uh, we can go take some dope pictures together you know uh, join the movement okay but yeah thank you for watching this fall I will see you in the next video peace what's up <laughs> just like staring at me this whole time. Oh my god, what the heck? I'm weak. Oh shit. <laughs> What's your name? Tuso. Tuso? Yeah. Yeah? <laughs> and you, how old are you? Mm, 11. 11? Yeah. Awesome, awesome. So you watched my video? Yeah. Wow, uh, how do you like it? It was amazing. It was amazing. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah, you, you looked at me. I was like, uh, Bro, who, who the hell is this? <laughs> I was kind of confused, you know? Like, I didn't know, like, uh, who you were or what the hell you were doing. Me too, when I saw the, uh, the truck, I was like, uh, when I watched the video, 
Oh. Oh, you know the van, right? Oh, you know the van from the videos? That's, that's awesome. <laughs>